Okay, so you're gonna hang here for a while. <laughs> as good a place as any to test the suit. Ready, Tortuga? All set. Okay, chillax. Let's do this. Activate sloth power. Oh, so this is sloth speed. The suit works. It's slow, all right. Very funny, Chris. Talk normally, please. I can't. But could hang forever with these arms and claws. Uh-oh! Maybe being a sloth's not as relaxing as I thought. Koki, what is that bird? Harpy Eagle, one of the most powerful eagles in the world. It says here they hunt monkeys and mainly sloths. I'm not a real sloth. Chris is getting carried off by an eagle. Martin's still missing. We're in trouble, guys. <gasps> oh. Activate! See, told you, not a real sloth. Wait! Oh, no! Need this? Harpy Eagle, you're just in time. Feather? Don't mind if I do. Activate Harpy Eagle power! Let's fly! These wings are awesome! Powerful! Quick turning! Awesome! Yeah. Huh. Hey, what was that? Chris? Hey, what are you doing? Hanging out with sloth power. <laughs> yes, the power of the sloth. Hanging out and hanging on. Get ready, bro! Catch this! Gotcha! Bombs away! Safe and sound. Last one, Chris. The Jaguar. And I'm ready for him. You're no Jaguar. Got him, Chris! Put me down! Okay. Oh. oh, I, uh, I was just leaving. <laughs> okay, we know how to use seahorse powers. Send us the power discs. Complete and on their way. Ha. Send them, Jimmy. Teleporting. Quick, touch a seahorse. Uh, not a problem. Activate seahorse, seahorse powers. powers! Let's go, Martin. We've got to save the seahorses and fast. To the creature rescue! <laughs> Why is the seahorse collector not collecting any seahorses? Uh, hmm? Dabio, prepare my submarine. Ah. Dabio, over there. Oh, hey, Danita. What are you doing here? Hmm. I would say nice outfits, but they're not. They do not complement your figure. Now, I demand to see the seahorses. Oh, well, Danita, the only seahorses on this reef are the ones right in front of you. Do not try to impress me with your little suits. Your creature power suits are never fashionable. Oh, yeah? 
Check this out. We can make them go your favorite color. Yellow? I can't stand yellow. Ugh. And if seahorses turn yellow, I can't stand them either. Let's get out of here, Davio. Yes, Anita. What did you guys do? Yeah, where are they all? What did you do with all the seahorses? Well, we used the powers of the seahorses to hide the seahorses. The power of the father seahorse pouch, to be exact. And here they are, floating free and in the wild. Dolphin discs are ready, guys, with echolocation and click whistle dolphin speak features. Awesome! Okay, Click. Ready for a couple more dolphins with souped up dolphin speak power? Activate, Activate dolphin power! Oh, yeah! Now, this is what I call swimming! The suit's working. It's picking up the clicks just like the hydrophone. We still have to figure out what they mean, though. Oh, a school of mullet fish. I bet that whistle means, I found food this way! Follow those dolphins! Hey, are you getting any of this? No, but it seems like they're making a plan for the hunt. Problem is, they're doing it in dolphinese. Well, how hard can it be? Let's just follow their lead. Huh? Ah! What's wrong, Click? Huh? What? Whistle? You're saying whistle. What about him? <coughs> that must be some kind of distress call. I think she's worried about whistle. Uh oh, I'll check it out. Okay, we'll stay here and decode this hunting stuff. Okay, guys, let's do this. Catching fish dolphin style! Guys, that click whistle must mean something like circle the fish! No problem, I'm with you guys. Oops, sorry, wrong way. This way, right? Ah, I got this now. We're herding the fish into a tight ball, a bait ball. This is genius. Talk about a smart creature. And by communicating, you can cooperate and work together. Oh, up. Got it. That whistle means move them up. You're pushing them right to the surface, aren't you? So they'll have nowhere to escape to. Oh, brilliant. Oh, now the feast begins. Dinner time for dolphins. No wonder they're one of the smartest creatures on Earth. A language, smart hunting strategy, and one of the largest brains for their size. It was some pretty complicated programming with the life cycle and all, but I think I've got it to where it'll activate directly to adult frog powers. It'll be great. We'll use our frog legs to head upstream to find the source of the ooze and stop it. While you guys try to contain the ooze and prevent it from entering the pond and reaching the frog eggs. Got it. We right. can do that. Activate frog powers! <laughs> tadpole powers? Oh no, I was afraid of that. It activated to the tadpole stage of a frog's life cycle. Come on, bro, we've got no time to lose. All I can do with tadpole powers is wiggle. Chris, try to touch another frog and reactivate. How am I gonna touch a frog and my disc without any hands? Heads up, we've got creatures fleeing from the goo. <gasps> Beaver. Bass. Oh, and here's a bullfrog. Oh, I know. Activate frog powers. Oh no. I just made it to stage two with hind legs, and I still have to wiggle. Oh, you're going to have to activate through every stage of a frog's life cycle to get frog powers. What? 
Hurry, Chris! Find another frog! Activate frog power! Okay, now I just made it to stage three with hind legs and tiny front legs. I've still got to lose this tail. <gasps> Come on, finish the life cycle, bro. I see the ooze. <gasps> Uh-oh, this is my last chance. Activate frog powers! <laughs> Finally, frog powers! Uh-oh. Let's get these frog powers jumping. To, to the, the creature, creature rescue! rescue! Huh? Zack? We've got to stop him. Zack, what are you doing? Well, one thing I'm not doing is dressing up in tiny weird animal suits. Whoa! Ah! You're polluting the environment. Who cares? It's already dirty. See? Uh, that dirt's called earth. It's natural, and animals need a clean environment to live. Ah! Yeah, you created these poisonous chemicals, so you've got to find a way to clean them up and dispose of them in a way that doesn't make the water dirty and hurt frog habitat. <laughs> oh, yeah? Who's gonna make me? Sea Turtle Power Disc programming complete. First, we've got to find Shield, touch him, and activate our sea turtle powers. Don't dive now. There he is. Dive now! Activate sea turtle powers! Okay, let's go find that master key. It fell somewhere near that giant brain coral. Keep your eyes peeled for that tiger shark. Look, the key landed here, but then disappeared. Check it out, Chris. Tracks of a crab or lobster or something. It walked right by the key, maybe picked it up. Why would a crab or lobster pick up a key? And how? I don't know, but it's the only lead we've got. Come on. Let's follow these tracks. Looks like a lobster to me. Now nah, go with the big old crab. Lobster, crab. There it is. Yeah, it's a crab. <laughs> a spiny crab. But big as a lobster. And she has the master key. <gasps> Tiger shark. And we look exactly like his favorite prey. Take evasive maneuvers! With you, bro! I'll lead him away! And I'll get the master key! All right, I'll just grab the key. Oh no, I don't have hands, I have flippers! How am I gonna grab the key? I don't know, bro, but figure it out, fast! I can't shake this shark! Oh, shield defense! The shark is hungry. Hurry, bro! Chris, you're lucky that we modeled the suit on the hawksbill turtle. They have two claws on their flippers. Check it out. Oh, yeah. The hawksbill doesn't use them for much, but you can. I'll use them to hook the bungee of the master key. Got it. Martin, I have the key. Meet you at the tortuga. I'll be there, bro. Just as soon as I get this tiger shark off my back. Oh! Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Hey, let's get out of here, bro. Yeah, two shark attacks is way too much for one day. Hey, check it out! There is such a thing as flying turtles! Anybody looking for the master key to the Tortuga? <laughs>